from Vince McMahon. Uh, Meltzer would say this was probably the most shocking thing in here. Quote, McMahon's cavalier attitude towards illegal steroid use. Here's what Vince said. Quote, if we found a syringe filled with steroids, we'd say, what the hell are you doing? But the audience doesn't give a damn. No one cares. End quote. What do you make of that quote from Vince? The audience didn't care. I I mean, there's nothing to make of it. I, I really and truly don't think that the audience gave a shit. Does the audience care? When uh, Brad Pitt goes from 130 pounds to 190 pounds to get ready for a role in a movie, they don't. They go, oh, my God, what kind of training regiment is he on? I don't think that the audience, I don't think that they cared then. I'm not sure they care now. It's not an actual athletic competition. It's entertainment. Isn't it amazing how little people really know or care? I mean, I hear people talk all the time about different guys, not just, not just wrestlers, but in other areas where all of a sudden someone's over 40 and goes from average to Jack to the gills. And no, no one even says anything, Uh, you know, they're just, it's complimentary. I'm with you. I don't think they really care. Yeah. I I just think that that people want to be entertained. And they don't care what someone's personal life or what they're doing to attain that. And what people leave out a lot of times is, um, hey, Conrad and I could take all the steroids in the world. (laughs) It ain't going to make any fucking difference. (laughs) Ain't going to make that big of a difference if we're not eating properly and training hours upon hours in the gym every day. So people forget about that. They forget about the the sacrifice that these guys have to go through to maintain the bodies that they have. Yeah. I think a lot of people assume that it's just, you know, you stick a needle in your ass and you look like Hulk Hogan and that's not reality. That's, that's not reality. That's hours and hours in the gym for years and years and years and eating lean chicken breast and dry pasta. So let's talk about the, uh, the, the way they sort of wrap up this, story with TV guide. They say that, uh, the rumors of steroid use may have added to wrestling's mystique, which I think is funny. And, um, it said that Bischoff was sketchy about WCW's testing program. And McMahon said the WWF only tests when they detect signs of abuse. Uh, do you remember what the official policy was here in 1998? In 98, I think we were at the random testing and he was testing for, I I don't know if we were even testing for pot at that time, but I know that drugs, drugs of abuse, I think, I don't, God, I don't even remember, but I think it was drugs of abuse and illegal, illegal drugs. So if you were getting a prescription, for example, of a muscle relaxer and you were abusing them then if you had too much in your system, they would test you for that and different things. I, but to be 100% accurate, I couldn't tell you what the fuck the drug testing was in this period in 1998. It would evolve so many times throughout the years. Rumor and innuendo is these days, if you fail for marijuana, it's a $2,500 fine. Have you heard that? Well, that's up from, I think you started out as a thousand dollar fine. Okay. Um, is it, is it true that one of the things you guys did for testing once upon a time is you was established, I believe the term is a baseline. And so they're just getting a, a sort of an idea of where your levels are. And even if your levels are elevated, as long as they're in that range, they're going to assume it's just business as usual. But when something goes way high or way low, that's when they throw the flag. For steroids, they did do a baseline test as far as if you had been taking steroids, they would test you and say, okay, here's where you are. Don't go over this. And if you're, they would have wanted to see those levels, if there were levels of steroids decrease actually. So if they decrease, they, there wasn't any alarm, but that was their baseline was my understanding that here's your baseline. You cannot. You know, if you go above this and obviously you're using, but we need to see you come down. 